let, let, let me ask you this. I mean, we share uh, one thing in common. Uh, we're white, uh, privileged, who uh, my father was a lawyer and a judge in Illinois, and we know uh, what your dad did. And uh, uh, do you have any sense that that privilege has isolated and put you in a cave to a certain extent as it put me and I think lots of white privileged people in a cave and that we have to work our way out of it to understand uh, the anger and the pain particularly black people feel in this country. Do you no, you, you really drank the Kool-Aid, didn't you? You switched it to you. Wow. No, I don't feel that at all. So many of his fans are white. I thought that was clearly a message that there was no such thing as racism. There was a lot of backlash from people about that. Would you change it, what you said, or no, you still feel the same way? What's your thought on, on Black Lives Matter? What is it? What, what do you mean? The idea is that there's this movement called Black Lives Matter, thinking that the rest of America didn't seem to understand that, that Black Lives Matter. That just sounds weird. I didn't know that you put a name on it. It's not a name. It's not whatever, whatever. It's somebody got shot by police and for a reason. I am a young, black, rich If that don't let you know that America understand black matter these days, I don't know what it is. Don't come at me with that dumb ma'am. My life matter, especially to my Do you separate yourself from it? I don't feel connected to a damn thing that ain't got nothing to do with me. If you do, you crazy as You connected to this Flag, right? I'm connected. I'm a gangbanger, man. I'm connected. He ended our interview angrily. <laughs> Lil Wayne is in the business of making music, not apologies. Yo, shout out to Lil Wayne, man. I don't even listen to a lot of rap no more because these motherfuckers get on my nerves. But the man bring up a great point, bro. This shit ain't gangster, all right? If you a so-called street nigga... You ain't with this dumb shit, all right? I got real problems. A motherfucker get shot that he ain't part of my shit. I don't fucking care. Let that motherfucker get what he get, bro. Get the fuck out of here with this shit. And then and in real shit, he made another good point too, yo. Whether it's crack or Coca-Cola, white people will buy your shit. Long as you got some good shit to sell. So shout out to Wayne, man. It's the conservative holding it down. YouTube, what up? I'm out of here.